Hello everyone, this is Susie Q of Susie Q's Bunting Babes, and today is Christmas Eve, so Merry Christmas Eve to everyone. Um, I just got finished doing a video um, showing how I changed Sophie's body out. This is Sophie that I have with me today. Um, and so what I wanted to do was do another video showing um, me putting um, Sophie's pajamas on. Um, she's going to be wearing PJs because it's Christmas Eve and she um, she needs to go to bed early tonight uh, with the, all her other siblings so that Santa Claus can come and bring um, everyone gifts. And so what I thought I would do, um, I left so Sophie um, unchanged from the last video that I did um, showing how I replaced her body. And uh, so I'm going to go ahead and set her down here. Well, I show you what I'm going to be putting on her. And as you can see, with her new body, she can now sit up, which is really nice. Um, she can sit up without assistance. And I just love that. Okay, so I'm going to be putting this butterfly diaper on. This is going to be her onesie. Uh, this is going to be her PJs. So the bottoms of the PJs have feet in them and they're little bunnies and then the matching top um, doesn't have bunnies it's got um, it's a plain blue that matches the blue in the background of the bunny PJs it's got little lace up here and then I'm going to be putting these little booties on her feet before I put the bottoms on so let's get started um, anyway uh, so yeah I changed Sophie's body out in my last video, and um, I'm very, very pleased with the results. Um, very, very happy with how she turned out. So, as you can see, she doesn't, her head doesn't, you know, pop up anymore. Um, her body doesn't pop up anymore. It's just so much more, um, she's so much more balanced. So, let's go ahead and get her diaper on. And, um, get her changed because all of the babies are really anticipating a Santa Claus coming tonight and so they they're you know they all have their PJs on and they're they said that they're gonna that they promise that they're gonna go to bed early um, so that they can get plenty of rest for because um, they're gonna have a big day tomorrow uh, at Christmas time so this little girl, um, she wears um, she's a she wears preemie size to newborn size. Um, her body is going is more preemie size, and then um, she can fit into newborn size too. But um, anyways, let's go ahead and get that on. I think she's still preemie <laughs> since I changed her body out. Yeah. Yep, she sure is. This is a preemie size um, onesie. So yeah, that fits perfectly. Just perfect. All right, and the next thing we're going to do, um, this is a little, um, this is also a onesie. It's a long sleeve onesie that I'm going to be putting on her. Um, I wanted her to have a long sleeve onesie on over the short sleeve because, it, you know, it's cold outside and I wanted to keep her snug. Snug as a bug in a rug inside. So when I get done changing Sophie into her PJs, I am going to go in the kitchen and make my mincemeat pie. Um, earlier in my other video, I had mentioned that um, my husband, he, cook, he cooks his breakfast every morning in there and uh, in the kitchen. And so he doesn't usually get done until, um, I don't know, 9 or 10 because he gets up kind of late. And so um, I was just kind of waiting for him to come out of the kitchen so that I could get my mincemeat pie going. So um, so I thought, well, I, I didn't realize I was, realize I was going to have so much time this morning um, to wait. So I changed Sophie's body out, and I thought, well, since I've changed her body out, I might as well, um, you know, put her in her PJs. So there's that Part. Let's put her little her socks on. 
the little booties they're kind of nice little thick booties just to keep her feet warm inside her PJs yeah these fit just right I used to use these on my my babies um, my kids and I love them because they they're sort of um, they snug up onto the feet and they're hard, really hard to kick off <laughs> so um, and I just really like the looks of them too all right so here's the PJs put those on and these are a size newborn you see they're um, Carter's newborn so they're going to be a little bit smaller than the normal newborn size and see the feet fits perfectly and I love this color of blue. This is such a pretty, pretty color. And I think Sophie, Sophie's got, um, it's hard to tell unless you look really close. Her eyes are a deep, deep blue. And she really looks good in blue, I think. So yeah, see, she's a, she's a perfect size newborn for her outerwear. But then she's, um, she's a perfect, uh, preemie for her other, for her, you know, her onesies and diapers. So anyway, I have Sophie all ready. She's all ready for Santa. And um, I think I'm going to, since these are the type of PJs that the little, um, the arms, the things fold over. What do you call those? The little, make them little cuffs. I'm going to do that to keep her little, um, her little hands warm make them into little little gloves I think that's a cute look for babies okay everyone um, so I have Sophie already and I'm gonna put her down for a minute because um, I wanted to talk about Augie has a new friend um, Augie has a new friend He's actually got a lot of friends now. Oh, my goodness, he um, he just made a new friend um, a couple of days ago uh, named Christopher Columbus that lives in Sweden and who lives with Mormer Helen. And then he made a new friend um, yesterday and the new friend's name is Mud. And that um, is an old, old teddy bear. I believe that um, he lives at De Deidre's house in Ireland and I believe that she said that Mud was 18 years old, that her daughter had um, given her Mud when the daughter was eight, when her daughter was eight. And so um, I think that's how it worked. Um, anyways, so now he has a new friend named Mud. And then in the UK, there are several teddies that live with Suzanne um, at Suzanne's Babies. Um, there are um, several beautiful teddies there. And so... You know, Augie is not alone anymore. He thought he was, but um, he's got a lot of friends out there now. So he wanted to come on and say hi to all of his teddy friends and, w and wish them a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And so I want to say goodbye to everyone. Um, and I hope you enjoyed my two videos today of Sophie. And I'm very happy with how she's turned out. Very, very, very pleased. And um, anyway, Merry Christmas to everyone, and um, I will uh, see you in my next video. Thanks for um, stopping by if you had time today, and um, hopefully I'll see you soon, and until we meet again, bye-bye.